This is Twit. Now, in an interesting posting from the NSA, they are – the NSA, the National Security Agency, are warning against outsourcing of DOH services. Um, in their seven-page advisory titled Adopting Encrypted DNS in Enterprise Environments, that which they posted last Thursday – the NSA warned against outsourcing DOH services to a third-party provider, which like at first glance might seem a little odd. But okay, so here's their executive summary. The first bit of it is, yeah, a little, you know, obvious to all of us. They said, use of internet relies on translating domain names like NSA.gov to internet protocol addresses. Right. This is the domain, this is the job of the domain name system, DNS. In the past, DNS lookups were generally unencrypted since they have to be handled by the network to direct traffic to the right locations. DNS over hypertext transfer protocol over transport layer security, HTTPS, often referred to as DNS over HTTPS, DOH, encrypts DNS requests by using HTTPS to provide privacy, integrity, and last-mile source authentication with a client's DNS resolver. All that's true, in case any of you haven't been paying attention in the last couple of years. Then they said, it is useful to prevent eavesdropping and manipulation of DNS traffic. While DOH can help protect the privacy of DNS requests and the integrity of responses, Enterprises that use DOH will lose some of the control needed to govern DNS usage within their networks unless they allow only their chosen DOH resolver to be used. Enterprise DNS controls can prevent numerous threat techniques used by cyber threat actors for initial access command and control, and exfiltration. So they said, using DOH with external resolvers can be good for home or mobile users and networks that do not use DNS security controls. For enterprise networks, however, NSA recommends using only designated enterprise DNS resolvers in order to properly leverage essential enterprise cybersecurity defenses, facilitate access to local network resources, and protect internal network information. The enterprise DNS resolver may be either an enterprise-operated DNS server or an externally hosted service. Either way, the enterprise resolver should support encrypted DNS requests, such as DOH, for local privacy and integrity protections. But all other encrypted DNS resolvers should be disabled and blocked. However, they said, if the enterprise DNS resolver does not support DOH, the enterprise DNS resolver should still be used and all encrypted DNS should be disabled and blocked until encrypted DNS capabilities can be further can be sorry can be fully integrated into the enterprise DNS infrastructure this guidance explains the purpose behind the DOH design and the importance of configuring enterprise networks appropriately to add benefits to but not hinder their DNS security controls the following recommendations will assist enterprise network owners and administrators to balance DNS privacy and governance. And I will blessedly spare all of us from any further of that. But for what it's worth, I completely agree with every sentence in that executive summary. I think they got it all exactly right. The only issue I might take is wondering about the value, let alone the necessity of enabling DOH within the enterprise at all. I, I really don't see what value it provides if your, if your internal 
LAN has encrypted D- DNS or not. Um, maybe that's a function of how big the encrypted LAN is. I mean, if, for example, once upon a time, HP was what? It was 15 dot, I think 14 dot and 15 dot. And if they somehow glued all of that into one single massive enterprise LAN, then, okay, maybe it would make sense to perform some encryption just because you've sort of created a, at that point, kind of a quasi-public LAN. It's so big. But but I really take their point. I, I think what what they're responding to is that there are a lot of individuals inside of the enterprise that are saying, hey, cool, I, I can blind my enterprise's IT to everything I'm doing. You know, tech and privacy-minded employees might want to sneak their browser traffic out of the organization without being monitored. But, you know, we always remind everyone that the use of employer networks is the employers to oversee and regulate. So I would think that enterprises would be entirely correct to block the use of DOH and require browsers to use standard DNS and the organization's DNS with whatever added security filtering and malware detection the enterprise might wish to deploy. And yeah, bring up DOH in the enterprise and then users' browsers can use that. But anyway, I, I, I appreciate it, I guess, the NSA just, you know, kind of pointing out that, that circumventing all of an enterprise's uh, controls by by immediately tunning, tunneling out to an external provider uh, is probably not the right thing to do. So anyway, uh, it was th- this this posting of the NSA was picked up by all of the of the various uh, security uh, monitoring websites. So I just thought I'd, I'd take a moment to say, yeah, I I think I see their point completely.